Hey you guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. Our channel is all about the food. We do taste tests, recipes, grocery hauls, and what's for dinner. And I am here today with a grocery haul from Trader Joe's. I haven't been in a while, and so this is probably the last time I'll be going to Trader Joe's before the baby comes. So I wanted to show you guys some things that I picked up for Howard and I um, to, well, try. There's some new stuff and then um, stuff that we just like um, and just wanted to have on hand. So I spent a total of $102.33 and I will jump in right now. So I will start off with produce first. We got some shaved Brussels sprouts and some broccoli florets and then we also got some butter lettuce. This is all stuff that we plan on eating up this week. And I had a craving for some mandarin oranges, so I picked those up, and I think they were $2.99 a bag. And then um, we really like this Kung Pao chicken. It has a good flavor. Now we don't care for the peanuts that are in there. The peanuts come in a separate package, and so I never add those in. We just eat them, you know, by themselves. And then we really like these tarts. So it's like a flatbread pizza, but it's really, really flaky, kind of like a like a puff pastry crust. So we like this one, which is with the mushrooms and cheese. And then we also like the one that has the ham. So we're getting, these are repurchases for us. This is a new purchase for us. I haven't seen this one before. And it looks like just a little flatbread pizza. It's big enough for a quick meal, probably just slice in half. So picked that up. Um, something that is new, I have not seen these, are these shrimp burgers. And um, I've been wanting to try them. So let me show you. First ingredient is shrimp, and then there's fish next. So I'm not a huge fish person, so I hope it doesn't taste really fishy. I hope it tastes more like shrimp. So. There's that, and you get four patties. There you go. And then I picked up some quick skillet meals. One of them is this linguine with the pesto and tomatoes. I really like that. This mirror orange chicken is a new purchase for me. I know people have been buying this, you know, forever. And the reason I have avoided it is because I really don't like sweet, um, like sweet skillet meals. And some people say that this is not that sweet. So I decided to give it a try. So I got the mandarin orange chicken and I'm really hoping that I like it. And then another thing that we are just trying um, out for the first time is this chicken chow mein. So we've got other brands of chicken chow mein, just not, the, not Trader Joe's of course. So we're giving that a try. And then we are also trying out the Trader Joe's um, fettuccine with grilled chicken. Normally, I just get the plain fettuccine, but um, Howard was with me today and he really wanted to try the grilled chicken, so we're gonna try that. Now, um, this is something I haven't seen before either. Uh, Howard really likes bao, and this is a Philly cheesesteak bao. So that was pretty, pretty interesting to both of us, so he wanted to give that a try. I probably won't try it myself because I really don't like the texture of the dough, um, but he was really excited about this. And then he just got the regular uh, Chinese style um, buns as well. Let me show you what it looks like. So that's what it looks like. And so again, this is for Howard. He really likes um, stuff like that, so that's his. This is mine. You guys know how much I like French toast, but I've never tried the Trader Joe's version, so I'm excited to try this out. And then we also got some chicken cilantro mini wontons. I haven't bought these in a while, but I really do like them a lot. And then Howard wanted these um, apple pie bars. Now I'm not into cereal bar, not apple pie, sorry. Apple bars, I'm not into cereal bars, but he is, so he grabbed that. Let's see, oh, and then he also wanted to try these cold brew latte dessert bars. So he likes coffee. I'm not a big coffee person. He wanted to try those out. I grabbed some mini quiche because we both like quiche. And this is, um, well, there are two flavors. One is mushroom and Swiss, and the other one is bacon and sweet onion. 
and go back up here. Turn it around so you guys can see it. Cinnamon coffee cake. I've been wanting to try this for a while and it looks really good. It's tiny, um, but we plan on, plan on having this for breakfast, so I got that. And then I saw this in their Fearless Flyer and I could not wait to try this. Um, these are mini cheesecake bites and you get maple vanilla, ginger snap spice, and peppermint and it sounded really good to me. And then Howard really likes like stolen and things like that. And they had a large one, but this was just 99 cents. You could sample it out. So he wanted to try that. Now, last year um, during my Christmas Trader Joe's haul, I picked these things up and they were so good. So I don't really care for like little Debbie has one. I think they're the Swiss rolls. And I don't like those at all. These I love. Um, they have a really good flavor, really light and fluffy, very chocolatey. It's so good. Love these things. I started to get two, but I didn't. And then Howard wanted to try these out. He really likes tarts and things like that. Um, I'm not into it, so these are his. And they have apple, cranberries, and that's it. Spices and a crust, a flaky crust. And then he also really likes plantain chips, so we got him a bag of those. Now normally I get him jerk and uh, jerk flavored. And he likes those, but he wanted to try something different. And then the very last thing that I picked up are these cookie mixes. So you get three cookie mixes and it was $8.99. And all you do of course is add the ingredients uh, like, you know, eggs, butter, etc. But the first one is a toffee oat, which sounded really good. Then a cinnadoodle and then a triple chocolate cookie mix. So I was excited to see that and to try that out. So this is everything that we picked up from our Trader Joe's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we hope that you do so and we'll see you guys next time.